It's your host, Jaleesa Raquel, checking in for Sheen Magazine. I'm live at the 2019 Trumpet Awards here in the ATL. Tonight is all about black excellence. Stay tuned as we bring you our red carpet exclusives. Okay. Checking in at the 2019 Trumpet Awards with the India Ari. It is such a pleasure to finally meet you. Thank you. So tonight is all about black excellence. What exactly is your definition of black excellence? Just being black, period. <laughs> you black and we already excellent. Okay. I so, meant that. I know you did. I seen all the tears in your eyes. <laughs> so I know that we're in a time right now where the women are coming to the forefront. We're speaking up and we're taking we're taking forefront for our women and our girls and protecting our sisterhood. Um, what is your take on the Surviving R. Kelly documentary and far as just us protecting our girls and our community? I think, you know, I think this is one of the good things about social media because people realize they're being watched and when you know you're being watched, you do the right thing. Right. You're more prone to do the right thing. And so I am pleased about the documentary. I want to see the Me Too movement take stronger root in the music industry. Definitely. Because um, we see some of the like white executives getting a slap on the hand and then getting another job. Right. And so I want to see it happen across the board. Yeah. That everyone gets, has to pay their debt. Yeah. And, but I think that just at this time in history, yeah. the feminine is rising up, period. So here to us to our community to in the industry, in corporate America, I think it's just, is what it is and it's time. But I also think that personally, I'm happy about this because it was starting to look like a parody. Like, y'all don't see this girl, she's 17. She got on the bra on the cover of her album. She's 17, y'all. Like, I'm happy that we're now educating people about what abuse actually looks like. And so that the women know too. Like it's not just, he's not just a creep because his hand is up here, he's abused because his hand is up here. Right. And so I'm happy that, I'm happy for the awakening because we need it, especially around womanhood, especially in this country. Especially, definitely. And, do you and especially feel, in the music industry. Do you feel like it was ignored by the media for a long time or is this something that our community is just used to sweeping under the rug? No, I think the world ignores women's needs and that's why we're now standing up because we have to. One of my fundamental philosophies in life is that we heal ourselves. You heal yourself. I heal my, black women heal ourselves. White women heal themselves. Each individual person heals themselves. And so I, yes, it was swept under the rug and I think it because it was swept under so long and so hard, people are now like, okay, it's a backlash. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for always speaking up and being a voice for our youth and our women and our community. Thank you. Um, this is Sheen Magazine wrapping it up with the India Irie.